All right, you guys. So here's the cool trail off the inner urban. Awesome, huh? So I have to um, admit right now, I, um, I have one of those lives that I think, man, oh man, it's good. Like, you know, don't pinch me because I don't want to wake up from this. But, um, but it wasn't always like that. And I tell you, right now there's a couple of people, a few people that are reaching out to me because they're just in so much pain, so much pain. And I'm not talking um, the physical conditions, that stuff, um, while it's important to clear that up, of course, and we can do that for people. Um, I'm talking about, in this case, um, serious emotional, mental, spiritual anguish. And, you know, when I was, I asked Jen once, um, when we were in a really dark time, at least I was, it was tough. We were outside, of course. I've been telling this story for a while now. You know, 34 degrees, raining, really windy in our tent. Um, ben was wheezing because of the toxicity that we were dealing with. Jen had a big red rash on her face. We were running out of money like crazy, fixing up this place that we were in. And, um, and I was awake at like two in the morning and Jen, Jen told me, you know, you got to get happy, man. This isn't working. And, you know, years later I asked her, what made you stick around? Like, you know, you could have left, you could have taken Ben and just said, I'm out of here. You could have gone back and lived with your mom or your aunt or, um, or your sister, you could have done other stuff. Um, or you could have insisted that we just give up and do something else right then. But, um, but you didn't and I asked you, why didn't you just bail? And I remember she said, you know, I just couldn't look down. I couldn't look down. And I had been looking down. She knew I had been looking down into the abyss, like, good Lord, what have we done? What have we created? Why is everything falling apart? And she said, I just couldn't do that. She, um, she had to keep looking up or down the path, she said. And, and thank goodness she did. And, um, and we found some real answers. And, you know, right now it's not like I have everything I want. You know, I really want to connect up with some big time players in the, in the medical freedom and health world and do some really big things or make, make a lunch foundation and give information to families for true healing of their kids and health information that's valid and useful and not based on um, misinformation that we've, that we had to deal with for many years. And so I've got all sorts of plans and yeah, it'd be cool to have a lot more money because then I could donate more to ICanDecide.org and Robert Kenny Jr.'s Children's Health Defense Fund. And, and so there's a lot more to do, but it's, it's going in the right direction. And one of the things, and I want to give it to you right now, if you want, is a really cool reality creation hack or um, thing to do that really moves the needle, really shifts things and gets the ball rolling. So if you're up for that, are you up for that? Because I, I, I want to tell you. So, so one of the things you can do is just to think to yourself, um, if you had what you really want, and I mean, you know, if you're dealing, I'm going to give you two, two um, reality creation or mindset hacks or things to do that I've enlightenment techniques, things to make things happen. So here goes the first one. Um, you could think if you had what you wanted, if you had what you wanted, who would you have become? Who would you become? And then there's a technique to do for that. For right now, just kind of sit with that. And it's really powerful just to sit with that and notice what comes up. The other, the other thing is, um, gosh, now I forgot it. Maybe that's one for, for right now. Maybe I'll make another video. So um, yeah, sit with who you would have become. Let's do with one and then I'll give you another video in a second. So try that out and, um, and then sit with it. Try not to do anything with it. Just kind of sit there without looking for the answer something really cool starts to happen. And I've told you before in the videos what to do with it, but I want to give it to you bigger so that you can um, really get it. And if you want the next step, and I don't do this as like a, just a marketing thing, although it's cool because it brings people into our world. But if you want to go deep with it and get two PDFs and a whole hour 
of going deep inside and shifting things, then you can go to ralphhavens.com forward slash enlighten up. And I say that because if I can get you to do more and go deep and do the hour training, you have a chance. So, so go grab that and I'm gonna make another video when I remember what the next part of this was. All right, talk to you all very soon.